how to troubleshoot a GE Series 6 PLC system. The GE Series 6 was designed and introduced in 1981. Even though it's been out for over 30 years, it's still installed in many factories due to its rugged nature. In the 30-year-old technology, you'll find that the CPU is made up of a group of cards instead of a single card. The first card will be your I.O. control, the second card your logic control, your arithmetic control, and finally your memory card. All of these units must be installed in a Series 6 Plus system to allow one full functioning PLC system. You will always have four LEDs on that first card. If any of those LEDs are out, your system is most likely not going to work. The power switch is here, on off, and then you have your run stop key here. These additional slots are for I.O. before you go to expand to an additional rack. The battery on a Series 6 is stored on the memory card. You will note they give you two connectors, one to put the new battery on before you remove the old battery. If you pull the old battery off before you put a new one on and you lose power, then you most likely will lose your program. Always install your new battery before you remove your old battery, especially if power is off. Right now with power off, your program is being held on that memory board only by this battery. That battery will last only six months if there is no power on the rack. If power is on the rack, the lifespan of that battery could reach as much as seven years. The part number is an IC600MA507. That's IC600MA507. <laughs>